Former Finance Minister Nklankla Nene says he didn't anticipate his axing. Recalling how President Jacob Zuma fired him, Nene says the meeting with his former boss lasted just more than five minutes. He found out on the same day the president announced his removal. Four months later, the much-talked-about strategic deployment to the BRICS bank hasn't materialized. And Nene is moving on. He now has a new job in the private sector, but is tight-lipped about it. It's not wise to talk about your future employment before you are employed because you might actually end up not taking up that job precisely because so some of these things can limit your chances of uh, getting into your new job because you have made, you have jumped the gun and made the announcement. You allow the announcement to be made by your future employer or your future principal because I'm not too sure whether this is employment uh, or, uh, I mean, <laughs> call it employment, but, uh, well, my gardening leave uh, is going to end shortly. Nene squashed public speculation that he was fired because he turned down the South African Airways Board's request to review the lease agreement with French aircraft maker Airbus. He was also reluctant to support the so-called unaffordable nuclear power program. Well, the, the reason advanced by the president was in relation to the, to the new deployment, and that is the uh, statement, the public statement that the president made, and I have no reason to speculate uh, on any other reason other than what the president said. Nene says he was surprised by the economic impact of his axing, which is said to have cost the country about 500 billion rand. We are in a global economic village and uh, whatever happens in our country, uh, you know, will have an impact uh, in, 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 the, in, the, uh, in the markets. And uh, of course, I was surprised by um, the magnitude, because I, I would have thought that uh, as a mere mortal, uh, it would, even if there was a movement in the markets, it would be something that would be short-lived. But uh, indeed, I was uh, a bit taken aback. Nene says he has no regrets on the decisions he took as finance minister and believes he acted in a professional manner to protect the country's fiscus.